This video has been made possible thanks to EA Game Changers. Hey guys, it's Peaches and welcome back to The Sims 4. Today we are taking a quick little look at the build and buy items from The Sims 4 Paranormal Stuff Pack, which is coming out on January 26th. And so it is a few days now and uh, I haven't... Uh, I don't know anything about this release, to be completely honest. This has been kind of a blur for me. Um, this has been kind of a crazy couple weeks. If you um, have been popping into my live streams, you probably know a few of the things that I've been going through, but it's uh, nothing to worry about. You know, just stupid things, adulting that I've had to deal with. Um, so yeah, I don't, you know, I know a few things. I know Miss Bonehilda is back with this pack, which is pretty exciting. You know, Plumbella is probably squeaking right now. <laughs> um, so that's kind of fun, and um, other than that, uh, I thought, I, you know, my first thought was like, oh god, no, please no. Um, but, you know, as after I saw the trailer, I thought it looked kind of fun. Um, however, I haven't tried any of the gameplay stuff yet. Uh, there, I know there's a new career, or a couple new careers. Um, <clears throat> there's a few things to do in this pack, apparently. Um, as for the stuff... I mean, the build and buy items. I've Maybe it's because I haven't reviewed a stuff pack in a while, but I feel like it's kind of lacking. I don't know. I feel like there was not many things. Like, the the, the things, the, the, the items that came with the pack were beautiful. There is not almost any building stuff. I think there's a flooring and a wallpaper and that's it. There's no windows, there's no doors, there's no fences, no nothing like that. Most of it is just uh, buy stuff, and it's not. There's not really that much. Um, I need to take a look at other stuff packs and kind of see how like the difference of the amount of items that we usually get compared to this one. But I feel like it's pretty small. I don't know. Um, I mean, though, probably the logic is that there is a lot more gameplay content than they usually put in stuff packs. So I'm not entirely sure. Um, but the point is. The items are really pretty. I do like them. They're kind of... I think they could go really well with uh, with Bohemian stuff. And this build... I ha I have only used base game and, um, and the pack. I know you can see the, the main door is from a movie hangout, but I do uh, realize this at the end and I think I'd remove it off camera. And I change it for a uh, vampire's door. So I used... Most of it is base game and paranormal. Pa I'm having a hard time saying it. Paranormal. Um, most of the stuff is from those two packs. The stuff that I use from vampires is just pretty much just the landscape and the flooring that I used inside. Everything else is base game and paranormal. Paranormal. <laughs> God. Um, so yeah, you don't really need much to download the slot. As I said, I do remove that door off camera. You're not gonna see me change it, but it, it is. You will see it in the end, uh, in the ending of this, the, in the screenshots at the end. So, uh, and yeah, I mean, I had a bit of a struggle with the wallpaper here because it is quite loud, um, and there's not a lot of matching wood. As per usual, um, the, the colors, it's very colorful, this pack. There's a lot of items with tons of different colors, and that's why I decided to go with the uh, flooring from Vampires, because I felt like it was a little bit less crazy. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, so I used this wallpaper, which is maybe a little bit too much, but my idea for this house was to be some sort of like fortune teller house, home. So it's very cluttered, very full of stuff, very colorful. Um, and I really like it. I like uh, the new curtains a lot. I like the new couches and the new chairs and all that kind of stuff. I mean, the items are all really pretty. I like them a lot, so no complaints there. And, um, and yeah, I, I mean, I don't really have much to say. Um, I'm curious about what you guys think. What, are you excited about this or not? Uh, again, as I said, my first impression was like, no, I was not very excited <laughs> about it. Um, maybe it's because I've been, you know, last year I haven't really enjoyed any of the new packs. 
that much. I guess Snow Escape was okay, but the, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm growing out of it. Am I growing out of The Sims? I don't know. I hope not. I do still enjoy building and stuff, but I've, um, you know, as you may have noticed, the last week, couple weeks, I haven't really uploaded anything. Um, as I said, it's been kind of a stressful couple weeks for me, and I just, I, I didn't really have the strength to, uh, to edit and upload videos. I don't know. I have no excuse to be completely honest with you. It's just been, it's just been weird. It's been a weird couple weeks, and um, I apologize for that. I apologize for the lack of consistency and all that kind of stuff. But um, yeah, so here you go. Here you go. A nice little, a nice little uh, build right out of the oven. <laughs> nice and warm for you. Um, but I am still streaming, uh, as I mentioned earlier. I am streaming every. Uh, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. Sometimes I do change the schedule a little bit depending on uh, things that I have going on in real life and stuff. But um, normally that is that is my schedule. And I've been live streaming lately a lot of Animal Crossing. Uh, I got a Switch. When was it? I think it was October, I believe. And um, I've been pretty hooked up on the game. I have to say it's uh, it's very cute, very relaxing, and very fun. I feel like I've been wanting to play things that are not as stressful especially since i am deep into fallout new vegas which is not ex exactly a very relaxing game so um animal crossing is a very good you know very good palate cleanser <laughs> and uh it was pretty cool i was um visiting uh some people's island I pre i'm pretty sure i mentioned this before but um you know if you guys ever I think I posted this on social media. This is what I'm trying to say. Uh, if you ever want me to like visit your island, you can drop your dream address. You can send me a uh, direct message on Twitter, or, um, or just you know tag me or whatever. And if you want, I would love to visit your island. I love visiting people's island um, because they're just I don't know. You guys have such good ideas. They're so. I don't know original and fun and it's I love I love to visit people's island islands and um, I've been doing that uh, on stream too. I just visit random islands not necessarily people I know or people who gave me their dream address But if you guys ever want I will probably post on Twitter again for you guys to like share your dream address and, um, and We can visit it on stream. I don't know. I thought it would be fun. If you put a lot of effort in your island, which I know a lot of you probably did. <laughs> lots of hours and lots of items and uh, lots of grinding in that game, that's for sure. And uh, will you like me to uh, to visit and whatnot? So, you know, it, I think it would be cool. I don't know. And back to build, I am actually pretty close to the end here. Um, this is a quick one, you know. I just built this house in... Um, <clears throat> what's it called the vampire world I don't remember uh, but you can put it pretty much in any lot that is 20 by 30 uh, you don't really need vampires for this for this build honestly it's mostly landscaping and just the floor and the floor you can change it for any other brown floor to be completely honest not really anything special um but yeah as per usual um, once this pack comes out, you can download this lot from the gallery. It will be linked in the description down below. As per usual, uh, you just click on the link and it will take you directly to the gallery and you can download it and it will add it to your um, to your own gallery. So there you have it. Uh, I'm gonna let you guys go. I hope you have a good week uh, if I don't see you in a few days or talk to you in a few days rather. Um, I hope you have a good week and I will see you all in the next video.